session today. We are right now live on 12 platforms, including Clubhouse, Instagram, Facebook, YouTube, LinkedIn. And I'll be more than happy to speak about the topic. All right, I'm just inviting more people. All right, let me invite more people. All right, I think Alex is going to end. <laughs> All right, thanks for your patience. How are we going? Yeah, do we need some well done, well done. Thank you so much, Alex. That was my favorite music. <laughs> That's really nice. Oh, you're so smart. You selected something which I love it. Yes, Last Christmas by George Michael. That, that was fantastic. Thank you so much. Oh, I forgot to make you moderator all right all right i should say hi and happy holidays to everyone here i can see such lovely friends here michael wow you're also here siddharth sepide nizam eric and also uh Pe let me pronounce i'm not good in pronouncing the name penotredi and everyone all right right now i'm live on 12 platforms and we are practicing to, you know, go live on a couple of platforms at the same time. So now we are live on Instagram, Facebook, YouTube, LinkedIn, Twitter, Clubhouse, and a couple of more platforms, which even I don't know the names. Anyway, right now we are live and, uh, you know, I created this club, B2B.Anjex, which our intention is just to find the friends and help people to, you know, get connected, do networking. And of course, it's also good for us because we can find so many good friends from all around the world. All right, I don't want to speak too much, but just a quick, 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 quick flight because I use the metaphor of the flight. And I always, because I, you know, when I'm the moderator in other rooms and sometimes I have time, I use this metaphor just to let the people visualize that they are all together passengers of the same flight. And I use this one and I always try to visualize that you can imagine that the beautiful planet Earth, this globe is like the airplane and we are almost 8 billion people, passengers of the same flight. And that will help us to know that so much we are related to each other, so much we need to respect each other, to love each other, to get connected because we are somehow connected. Even you want or you don't want it. That was a big lesson. That was a great lesson from coronavirus, which I repeated this one a few times within the past few days in different rooms, that I guess coronavirus gave us a big lesson that we are so connected. We cannot be indifferent. If someone somewhere, anywhere in the world has the coronavirus or COVID-19, you cannot be indifferent, right? So that's why I, I myself love to use this metaphor. So be ready for a quick takeoff. And after this takeoff, I want to pass the mic to you. And the topic is how to give an elevator pitch. So probably our room will be very short. I don't want to, uh, you know, speak too much. And hopefully this room will be around 40 minutes, 30 minutes, because after that, we want to go for celebration here in Melbourne, Australia is 8 p.m. And Alex wants to fly and I should go home as well because my wife is waiting for me. You know, happy wife. Happy life. So <laughs> anyway, so be ready for a quick flight, quick takeoff. I love this metaphor. I hope you enjoy the flight as well. So flight attendants, prepare for takeoff. And cabin crew, please take your seats for a wonderful takeoff together. All together, we want to take off. All right, that was so quick. All right, thank you so much once again. Thank you, Michael, Eric, Sepide, Sidoth, Alex, and uh, Pentaridi. Pen Pen I'm not good in pronouncing the name. Anyway, if you are available and you can speak, I'll be more than happy to pass the mic to you. But uh, one more time, I want to remind everyone that we are right now live on 12 platforms. 
Alex shared the link of the YouTube. You can just watch me right now from YouTube. Yes, live. And also you can click on my bio, find the Instagram under my bio or Twitter. You can click and you can watch me or even you can join. All right, let's go. If any of you are ready to speak, please flash your mic. I'll be more than happy to pass the mic to you. I can see Hala is there and Maria also. Let me invite them to the stage if they can speak. All right, if any of you is ready to speak, just flash your mic, introduce yourself, or if you want to share about the topic, let me know. If not, I'll continue. All right, so uh, the first thing, I just want to say that uh, Anjex is the Australian-based company, and I'm the CEO of the company. Alex is also in the same company. So uh, based on the topic that I want to, we want to speak about the elevator pitch, the, one of the things in elevator pitch is to manage the time. It means we shouldn't spend so much time. For example, you are going to an elevator, all right? Imagine you are a businessman and you are going to an elevator in the lift. And suddenly you see a very important person, VIP. So how long it takes to go from, I don't know, first floor to 10th floor? Maybe 30 seconds, right? Or 40 seconds or one minute. So you have only one minute or 30 seconds to introduce yourself, to present yourself. So you need to have something with you, of course, that's business card. And here, your business card is your bio. In the flight, I say your bio is your boarding pass. But if you are talking about the topic, your business card. If you have a business card ready, you can quickly introduce yourself within the 30 seconds. Just try to raise the curiosity of the person. And after that, that's, that's how to take action. I have a teacher here. Alex is uh, my teacher. <laughs> Always correct my English. So you take action and then you present your business card after you introduce yourself in 30 seconds. So that's how I guess we want to practice and see how we can actually use this metaphor. Uh, oh, I can see Santosh also. Let me invite Santosh to the stage. And there are a few tips also. If you Google, you can find lots of tips, of course, how to... Uh, have a right, you know, um, elevator pitch, or if you want to write an elevator pitch. So become an expert on the product and service you sell. It means, of course, you need to know about what you are selling, what you want to present. That's another thing which I always ask people to complete your bio, to have a wonderful bio, because it shows that when you respect yourself and you complete your bio, you try to introduce yourself to the people, that people can know you better. So that's another secret of uh, introducing yourself. So I think it's ho ho useful for the, uh, this topic, elevator pitch. And know your audience. <clears throat> so you need to clarify and explain, uh, I mean, clarify your target audience. For example, in bio, you can see my main target audience uh, based on our business is dermatologists, ophthalmologists, doctors, or those that are in skincare, because we are producing this skincare product, anti demodex mite skin treatment so that's obvious that i need to target uh, basically the people that are in the same industry so it depends on your uh, profession you need to clarify and uh, your target audience and know them the other things is highlight the key points of your products and services for example our products uh, is very unique and special because it can eliminate demodex mites and we achieved the best invention award 2012 at the same time, our products uh, can destroy the coronavirus. That's a new feature of products. So that's something I need to be aware. And when I have very short time, if I see someone in the elevator and I need to present my product, so I should quickly say, yeah, if, if the people suffer from skin issues like acne, rosacea, blepharitis, seborrheic dermatitis, we have a solution for that because there is something neglected, the role of the parasite under the uh, skin. So that's a quickly. And then I will try to raise their curiosity to let them come and, you know, uh, check my bio and information. So the, the other step is build your research into a foundation. The other thing is time. Time is very important. So if, if I'm a very talkative person and I want to spend 20 minutes in the elevator, so definitely I don't have enough time. Uh, to, you know, I cannot manage my time properly because I have to manage my time somehow to express myself just within 30 seconds. And practice. Practice makes perfect. You need to practice. I think Clubhouse is a good place for both practicing and also, uh, you know, teaching, learning, finding each other, 
like now you all, all awesome people here. And speak clearly. We should be very clear in what we want to express. That's all for me. And now is your turn. If you can speak, please flash your mic. Let's see. Eric, are you there? Do you want to speak? Let's go. Oh, yes, Eric. Thank you for being here. Mic is yours. Okay, let me try giving an elevator pitch, actually. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> Wonderful. One, Just one thing, Eric, before you start, because right now we are live on 12 platforms. If it's okay for you and you allow me, I'm going to uh, actually uh, turn my phone toward the camera so other people from other 11 platforms, including Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, LinkedIn, they can also resonate with your bio and with your share. Is it okay? Uh, yeah, how does that work? I thought this is uh, Clubhouse. So how are you getting it onto other platforms? Yeah, you see that Alex already shared the link on the top of this page. See YouTube. If you click that, I'm right now live on 12 platforms, including Clubhouse, because we have lots of people, clients on different platforms like Instagram. Or if you go to my bio and you click on the Instagram, you can now watch me live. So what I'll do, I... I uh, turn my phone toward the camera. So for example, when you start speaking, the, your bio, your picture, your voice uh, can go through other 11 platforms simultaneously. That's what I'm doing myself. So I'm practicing to go live at the same time on 12 platforms. Does it make sense? Gotcha. Okay, that makes perfect sense. Yeah. <laughs> I just wanted your permission because I know, of course, it's positive that you are here when you speak. So it means and replay is on. It means after the uh, the room uh, ends, you can still find the room because there it is recorded. But I just wanted to let you know that I'm gonna go live. I mean, I'm live right now, and your voice will be live on twelve platforms. Anyway, it's yours now, and Mike is yours. Go ahead. Wow. Okay. <laughs> Uh, now that I know I'm on 12 platforms, let, let me try to pitch something else. Then. <laughs> okay, so here, I think this is, uh, uh, you know, the, you know. The, thanks for having me on stage. Uh, I'll just quick uh, give a quick elevator pitch here. Let's see if, uh, you know, it's, it's clear to everyone. It's just for practice, uh, just for fun. Um, so I have a lot of different ideas, um, but... Uh, Let's just give one quick elevator pitch. So, so, so here's the idea. Um, I think this space is incredibly interesting, which is gaming and NFTs. It's taking the world by storm. So, um, I, I think there's three things to consider, which is creating an, an, an incredible game that leverages the blockchain technology to put um, the data in the user's hands and also allowing uh, the users to monetize while playing the game. So in other words, the technology we're trying to create uh, is uh, basically uh, plays on those three principles. An incredible game, an incredible user experience uh, for the end user. And while the user plays the game, he also has the you know, opportunity to uh, monetize uh, based on the blockchain. Um, and so that is my elevator, elevator pitch. Uh, would love to raise money for this idea. Thank you. Wow, <laughs> that was wonderful. Thank you for managing the time. Of course, it's a good practice, but you're wonderful. Thank you so much for your beautiful, amazing elevator pitch. At the same time, I was displaying your bio in front of the camera. So you were so quick that I didn't have time to do everything, but that was really nice. Thank you so much, Eric. You're amazing. I displayed your bio and your voice broadcasted on 12 platforms. All right, let's go to the next lovely person, which I want first to help me to correct my, my pronunciation. Pen, Pentaredi, Pentaredi. Please correct me, and Mike is yours. Yes, thank you so much, uh, sir. Uh, myself, Pentaredi. Yeah, that's correct. You are pronouncing correct. Thank you. Okay. Thank you for, thank you so much. Sorry, I'm very bad in pronouncing the name. You are a wonderful name. All right, go ahead, please. And also, I'm displaying your bio and information in front of the camera for other 11 platforms, if I hope that you are okay with that. Yeah, sure, I'm, I'm uh, ready to go for all kind of platforms. Sure, go ahead. Yeah, yeah, stage is yours. Stage is yours. 
thank you thank you so much for giving the opportunity uh, i will tell how you can pitch the elevator pitch okay it could be while you are practicing what otherwise you can go through the investor uh, investor pitch also you can do that i will give quick introduction about me and after that i will go to the topic well i am pantaradi from india i am a founder and ceo of pantaradi and dot com and i am a global business consultant it it consultant i am a leadership coach for more updates you can read my bio i have listed the services in my bio you can reach out me via email once you go to my website all social media profiles you can able to check out i think it's my short bio okay let us go to the today topic elevator pitch minimum start from 3 minutes 5 minutes 3 to 5 minutes that's it that's called elevator pitch we don't want to take too much time for introduction we needs to finish within a 30 seconds your introduction because without a person company or any ngos cannot be formed right that purpose we needs to give our introduction your first name or full name whatever you are comfortable you need to tell your name first and if you go into the global menu global uh, context you needs to tell which from which country you are from because audience wants to know which country you have came from to speak there that's also a great thing if you tell that other thing what is your title title is nothing but it's a role in the organization it could be managing director ceo chief operating officer chief financial officer chief technical officer chief legal officer many roles will be there right as for your role you are entitled to tell that you need to tell that if you have any qualifications if you are comfortable you can share otherwise uh, it's not a big matter but at least you need to have some industry experience let's say someone is working in the finance or fmcg or retail chain or supply chain and management blockchain technology and science and technology many many kind of industries are there science and technology it comes to the it okay which our industry you are into you need to have some experience that's more than enough because everybody knows college school uh, degree no one is uh, going to benefit in the business but anyway basic foundation is very important if you have good uh, average uh, so no problem whatever you have completed the school or colleges that's enough don't regret about that whatever you have done certifications you have any certifications if you have any taken good workshops like top uh, brand names something like that uh, courses will be provided right if you have any certifications that's okay just don't uh, go too much within a 30 second we have to introduce ourselves once you complete yourself you need to go about your company because you came here to pitch the company or your personal branding whatever it could be main ten, main intention is to first about your company what is your company deals with it could be product it could be services okay product and services these two things are clear which space you are into b2c b2b which are your comfortable nowadays direct to consumer also is going to be popularized that also you can able to tell based on your the next thing segment which segment you are working into once you know that people can uh, understand you well investor needs main things is what is your revenue model because without revenue model uh, investors cannot be funded you right that's very important business planning is very important before starting any business it will like a foundation of the organization it will teach you from the marketing sales finance and your forecast your resources 
everything you are a managing director board of directors whatever it could be everything will come into the business plan that's why you needs to prepare business plan you cannot able to tell in the uh, business plan but shortly if you are comfortable just uh, go through the simply overview like that once you go through overview revenue models always prefer really more than two it's better only one revenue model nowadays it's not so easy to get a funding because one idea why i am telling more than two uh, revenue models no one knows right what kind of uh, pandemic or what kind of disaster will come into the play we cannot able to go away right once we get, uh, get the funding that purpose at least you need to have a two or more two is better because one is failed also you, you have a backup plan to run the organization revenue model is done who is your board of director or company managing director ceo because that's a very important managing management team is very important while investing in the company without a management com- uh, team company will not function properly that purpose every investor look for your management once you clarified that next thing is how do you want to scale scale is very important what is your scale strategy what is your uh, growth strategy how do you compete with the uh, other market player in the market what is your difference like let's say imagine a products is there and you are also dealing with the b products same what is your difference otherwise if you have same products also who is your competitor you need to know who is your competitor otherwise it's not so easy to run the business right once you know the competitor you needs to analysis and once you done the analysis you needs to go through the based on your calculated risk what you can able to make customer experience better or innovations or uh, customer uh, once they call you how to give quick response you need to put like 24 by 7 customer care helpline means customer is the king right without a customer uh, this business will nothing will do nothing to do with the business that's why we cannot able to play with a pricing strategy always everybody knows right don't go into that too much because if you go into the pricing strategy it will affect your business model and revenue models and your organization operating cost will be not come into the organization the many things will come into the play that's why directly don't tell to uh, tell to the investor uh, uh, our price is very affordable or uh, very economically that pricing is everybody can deal with that but what is your special options or special investments it could be proprietary technology if you have any patent copyrights trademarks if this kind of things will protect you that purpose you needs to if you have any patent something like that you can able to tell the uh, investors so that they can able to trust right it's not so easy to wind up the patent tomorrow once you created the like that at least you have a some value once you created the patent co- copyright trademark and business all those things you need to have some separate technology in the market they are not having means it's not like that let's say i'm in india my technology not in india but other countries while pitching i don't want to think about my technology is in the global market my technology not in my in country that's what i adopted from the foreign technology foreign companies and i'm giving service to the my clients that's very important right while dealing with the technology you can able to take that advantages as well but you need to have a repeated uh, technology it's not like old technology if you keep on and uh, we are telling we are uh, so uh, smooth experience 
very fast experience through the technology, quick response, all those things. Whatever we, we are doing right, we have to do with the harness, yeah. with the interest. Absolutely, absolutely. I, I you are absolutely right. Yeah, thank you very much. I appreciate for your share. Excellent share and golden nuggets. That was really lovely that you said for introduction. We need to use around 30 seconds and then therefore elevated P3 to five minutes. That was really good. And I also took the note because that's why we are here to learn from each other. Thank you so much. I shared the link of your bio here to encourage the people that they even they may check the, this room in future. They will also, uh, if they resonate with your speech, which definitely they will, they will follow you. All right, I can see some more lovely people. I invite them to come to the stage. Yes, Dominica, thank you for being here. All right, I also shared the link of your bio and encourage the people to follow you. At the same time, as I said, I'm live on 12 platforms, including Instagram, YouTube, LinkedIn, Facebook, Twitter. So you can actually watch me now as well. If you go to my bio, under my bio, you can find the Instagram and Twitter link and you can click on that. Of course, I will share the YouTube again, the link. All right, let's go to the next person. If anyone on the stage ready to speak about the topic, just flash your mic one more time. I want to say happy holidays to all of you and Merry Christmas in advance for you, beautiful people. All right, anyone uh, wishes to share about the topic? Please, yes, yes, hey, let me pronounce your name. Oh, your name is also long, wrong. Maybe I pronounce your last name ready. Ready? Go ahead, Mike is yours. Yeah, thank you, Syed. Uh, nice to meet you. You meet you all, all people. And uh, so, can you? I can see the heading as how to give an elevator pitch. Your insight plus networking. So, uh, I come from a pharma. My educational background is PhD pharmacology. Uh, so we started. Uh, an R&D startup in 2016, which is into developing molecules, developing formulations, and generating patents. We generated 12 patents and licensed two, two patents. And uh, in 2019, we, we started a digital therapeutics company. Recently, we are shortlisted for uh, Y Combinator as well. And uh, I can remember this, how to pitch for, I mean, in an elevator pitch. Y Combinator asks for to complete any answer in less than 10 to 15 seconds. So we should speak in a very layman language as if we are speaking to some uh, kindergarten kid or some 70 year old uh, grandmother. That simple we have our, our uh, presentation has to be. But at the same time, when we hook the conversation with other person, we should be able to gather or navigate through the philosophical part of it so when i say philosophical part for all the technology products i'm not speaking about some hard tech or biotech companies for all the technology products network effects is a primary thing uh, which will give that value for the consumers you know what i'm doing i'm practicing to use the clubhouse together with the instagram twitter facebook youtube linkedin lots of platforms together. So that's why anytime is my session or we have rooms at Clubhouse, I'll go live on other platforms and encourage the people to use their Clubhouse as well. Competitive <laughs> model we have, or the vote what we have for a business model. The network effects has to be integrated into all of these topics. And that will, that will give a broad understanding for someone who's listening to it, who's demand expertise that's our point yeah wonderful thank you so much thank you for your share thank you for wonderful points i followed you appreciate if you follow back as well and i want everyone to follow uh, can you pronounce your name for me to learn <laughs> you can call me shiva shiva all right that's a nice name all right shiva so please uh, check uh, shiva's bio and uh, let's do it. And at the same time, Shiva, I was displaying your bio in front of the camera for other 11 platforms. And uh, let's uh, check out his bio. And then you can find his Twitter as well. You can follow him on his Twitter. 
And uh, yeah, that's I think following each other is very good because we can do networking when we get connected mutually. So Shiva, I followed you. Appreciate if you follow back to get connected. And I should also invite you in future because anytime we have rooms, I can ping you, invite you. So that's another advantage of following each other. You know, in my bio, I mentioned the reason because many people ask me when I am going to different clubhouse rooms and I try to encourage the people to follow each other. Even right now, I'm live on 12 platforms and always encourage the people that they have not installed the clubhouse on their phone. I always encourage them, try to motivate them to, ins to install this wonderful application on their phone and then they can just search and find the rooms and clubs which they like, like our rooms. They can just search UNGEX, U-N-G-E-X, and they can join us. And then when they are here with a complete bio, with a real picture, they can just come to the stage, share their thoughts, because sharing is caring, share, sharing is helping. Then when we know each other, we need to take action. And that action is following each other, because when we follow each other here, we can get connected and build a relationship. All right, thank you so much. Let's go to the next lovely person on the stage. If any of you ready to speak, please flash your mic. This room is going to end very soon. So I want, yes, Michael, Michael, you are awesome, incredible. I thought probably you're busy. Thank you for being here, Michael. <laughs> Mike is yours. So, you know, first of all, I just wanted to applaud you for your energy level. It's off the charts. It's awesome. Really love it. So, um, <laughs> Thank you. Actually, you you are one of the most powerful and amazing people on Clubhouse. And anytime you are a moderator in uh, in um, uh, Manny's uh, club, in um, uh, what was the name? I was just a mindset. You, mindset. yeah, you are really wonderful. You are really wonderful. Thank you so much for accepting my invitation to come here. And yes, uh, Mike is yours. At the same time, I want to link your uh, bio and uh, display your bio in front of the camera. Mike is yours, Michael. Sure, thanks so much, thanks, Syed. I just want to let you know, like, I'm really impressed by what you said about your company, okay? So we'll talk about that later, your product. It sounds awesome, first of all, okay? Uh, it's, it's a pleasure and honor to be here. I just want to give some ideas on, um, on pitching. These are just my ideas. You know, um, I think shorter is better. Like, you know, if you can do a five-minute pitch and condense it down to three minutes, that's great. If you can condense it down to a minute, that's even better. And if you can, even if it's like a complicated idea, try to you know get it down to thirty seconds. That's amazing because you know the the real cru crux of the matter is with everything like the internet, all the com competing media. Everything is starving for our attention. Everybody's wanting our attention. We have about a seven minute, sorry, a seven second, not a seven minute, a seven second attention span to grab attention. So that other person probably has seven seconds if you've caught their attention. So it also depends on your tone of your voice, your attitude of gratitude, your clarity, your intention, your energy level, like Saeed, he's got my attention, right? This high energy level. And also, like, the story that you can, I mean, yes, you know, if you're selling something, it usually takes longer than seven seconds. But what I mean, like the other fellow who was talking before me, uh, Shivan, I believe, he was talking about, you know, 30 second intro to, to grab the attention. And that's so true. I mean, have you heard Forbes Riley, the pitch queen who does 2.5 billion in sales on pitching products? She's the queen of this. And I, you know, I'm humbled. And yeah, I can pick up a phone and get somebody interested in, in a film deal. But it's not that easy all the time because it also depends on your mood, your nutrition, how much rest you've had. You know, all of these things play a part in your environment, if it's set up. So, Pitching is really, you know, you gotta you gotta establish the trust, and then somehow get the interest and in the product on them, attention, interest, you know, what is it, the ADA? What is that? Attention, interest, uh, desire, it. What was the other one? But attraction. <laughs> I gotta remember that that moniker. But but um, you know, 
who you are, what you do, and what do you want, you know, basically, in a way that's like, like, you know, for me, like, like, you know, what I, and I've learned this, and I'm still trying to perfect it, but for me, in the film court, film deal, I have this course called Film Deal Blueprint that I've developed, and so it's almost in the soft launch, but I'm not doing any advertising, I'm just, you know, going to put it out there and see what happens by talking to people about it and so what that is about is like it's about helping people and this these are not you know recommended by people in the investor world but uh they said don't use these words don't use bigger don't use better don't use faster that's what they said when i was in a due diligence class with some investors some angel investors so i thought why is that let me actually use it <laughs> and turn it around because you know that can still grab attention and maybe not in the investor uh, world but I think it can it just depends on the rest of your message so the film deal blueprint for me is about bigger and better film deals faster bigger because instead of a smaller budget you want to have a bigger budget or a bigger profit better because you have to have a polish you have to have the good story so I have six models in um what the film deal blueprint is about so first it's about you know uh polishing a script getting a story down and then having a phys a film biz mindset and so forth i don't want to bore you right now and then uh, not that i'm boring you but maybe i'm losing attention because i'm going too long and then better uh, so bigger better and faster because if you do all the essential steps and cover your bases, you're going to lessen the chance of them asking you questions because when they ask you questions, yes, they can be interested, but it's also because they don't know enough because you have not communicated articul articulately. Sorry, you haven't been articulate enough to communicate some information clearly for them to get it. And so bigger, better, and faster because then if they get it, they're going to want to do the deal. And then it's up to you to walk them through the deal and close it and do the paperwork, whatever you need to do. Get the order. What's that other acronym? AAFTO, always ask for the order. Hey, I don't know that much. Like, I'm just, I don't want to say I know everything. I don't want to say I know nothing. But I've learned in this world, we all know about 0.01% or 0001% of everything out there. You know, uh, we just know stuff ourselves, what we are good at. And a little bit about me, I was always in the top, not always, actually most of the time, <laughs> in the top 10% of the sales reps, sometimes the top sales rep in the companies I worked at. And I worked from little companies to big, huge companies. And it was always to do things like make that extra call or do that extra pitch. You know, you know and just do that one extra piece of action that can make a difference and add to your paycheck or add to your bottom line. And so, yeah, we all could always polish and adjust our pitch when we don't know it up, when it's not working. People, too. Again, like, I'm here to learn more. You're the pro, Saeed. Like, you're a successful guy. I'm just kind of like, you know, we're not but I have a vision and that's it. So I'll land my plate. Thanks so much for having me here. It's awesome. I love this room. It's, I love your little pitch room. It's going to grow, man. Yeah, thank you so much. Thank you, Michael. You are amazing. Amazing. Thank you for being here, Michael. I really enjoyed. First of all, I should appreciate for your support to come here and accepting my invitation. And second, that was amazing share. You are always good. You are always wonderful. And I was really impressed by your speech, by your excellent share. Michael, you are wonderful. And I actually was displaying your bio, your voice uh, on other 11 platforms. And I'm very happy that I can find so many good friends with this tool, with this application.
this this uh, uh, clubhouse I think is a game changer in networking because we can listen to the people we can learn from them like Michael he's always he is always has the um, golden nuggets for us all right it's time to take action to everyone because this room is recorded the replay is on and also many people right now they are live with with us on other 11 platforms including instagram youtube facebook twitter linkedin so let's let's know michael more click on his beautiful profile picture right now let's click and after that click view full profile everyone please do it now even if you are just watching the replay you can do it now and you can follow michael michael is amazing amazing person and also he's the one of the best moderators in mindset club which i recommend you to uh, be a member of that club as well mindset by manny and michael is one of the best moderator there is he's, he's a source of inspiration and motivation all right let's check out his bio okay, <laughs> <laughs> thank you thank you so much thank you for your help all right and support and your kind words all right let's uh all right let's check his bio right now and when you check his bio remember you can also screenshot that and read it again later because that's something that you need to know him more and have the all information about him all right you can find all the information about him is into awesome creative and entrepreneurial projects, field, music, and health. And uh, current location, Vancouver. Wow, beautiful Canada. You know, we are totally in different time zone, but that's so nice. Here it's 8.44 p.m. Michael, what time is it there? Oh, that is 1.45 <laughs> in the morning. <laughs> <laughs> totally different, but, but that's, that's lovely. I think the clubhouse, is so good that could connect all the people from different parts of the world. We don't need visa to know each other. You know, just you need to have a complete bio and then come here and find the good friends. Like, that's why I use a metaphor of the flight and see we are all passengers of the same flight. Normally, when you have an international flight, you can see many people from different countries in the airplane. So here is also same. All right, everyone, I already linked this uh, uh, bio uh, link on the and I pinned it on the top. You can just click on that or click on his uh, profile picture. Please uh, check out his bio and remember to follow him. And after you follow him, remember there is one more feature. Every single feature has some reason. The, the bell. Please click the bell and change it from sometimes to always. It means set it on always, on blue. So anytime, anywhere Michael speaks, you will receive the notifications on Clubhouse. And also you can find his Instagram and Twitter. Let's click on his Instagram. I'm showing at, at the same time in front of the camera. You can see so many beautiful pictures and information and follow him. Yes, I followed him now as well. Of course, we were in touch through, uh, because I have a couple of different Instagram, I, I follow the people with different IDs. And also follow him on his Twitter in twitter into a health healthy fulfilling lifestyle beautiful one more time thank you michael let's go to the next lovely passenger if you are ready to speak please flash your mic there we are going to end the room very quickly but i'm still once very interested in knowing more people and listening to you siddharth wonderful siddharth mic is yours Thank you so much, uh, Said, for giving me the opportunity to speak over here and be the part of this wonderful discussion happening over here. Season leading stall, the moderators, people in speakers panel, and also in the audience panel who are listening to me right now. I'm based in India right now, and uh, I'm really great to be a part of this wonderful discussion. Um, um, having said that, uh, before I say about how to give an elevator pitch and a mindset and uh, networking are the same thing, um, I would be saying that uh, when you're starting an elevator pitch, that you just make sure that you have proper uh, pitch to start. It means your your pitch of voice should be um, courteous with everyone. Uh, uh, being courteous, it should be uh, pretty much confident uh, that you are you're, since you're presenting uh, your uh, you know your business, your your profession in front of others. So you should be having a proper confident tone. Uh, uh, confidence in tone is, is mandatory. Second thing that when you when you are uh, you know when you are 
just speaking uh, or, or, or over any medium, let it be either uh, you know, offline or online media, uh, online mode of uh, presentation. Just make sure that your uh, your voice is audible on the other side. So do keep try to check that your voice is audible with the people that the people are able to hear you. Sometimes it seldom happens that the network becomes glitches and people are, you're not able I to, need to take uh, off you know, present uh, yourself yeah. in front of others. So that becomes a big barrier when you're presenting. Oh, okay. So think yeah, that your communication should be strong. Uh, you should have a strong uh, way of presenting because that also makes a very great impact on the audience. <laughs> and fourth thing that when you are speaking, you should be connecting with the audience so uh, frequently in between a presentation and try to keep it keep, keep asking some questions as well from the audience that are you enjoying or are you able to give me or, or are you able to resonate with what, what i'm saying or if you have any sort of questions or queries that would be uh, pretty helpful and also uh, uh, once uh, you are done with the presentation everything is done to uh, present a quote of thanks and people who are you know, who made it important who made uh, they are a valuable a contribution towards uh, making the presentation successful and also uh, some bibliophiles and also the quote of science and acknowledgement. So these are, these are certain key points I believe that are really going to help you out when you're going to pit, give your elevated pitch uh, in front of people and uh, definitely that's really going to help um, a lot uh, in front of uh, uh, audience uh, irrespective of the fact that they might be of any level uh, and uh, you're presenting in front of any number of audience either 10, 20, 30 or thousand. So that's pretty much my two cents over time. This is that I'm complete. Thank you so much, Saeed, once again for giving me the opportunity to start and complete. Wow, thank you very much, Siddharth. You are so good. You are so kind that I always see that you support our rooms. You join our, our rooms. I really appreciate that, Siddharth. I shared the link of your bio here. I pinned it. And at the same time, I displayed your bio in front of the camera for other 11 platforms to know you better. And now it's time to take action. Click on Siddharth's profile picture right now to know him more. He is a wonderful person from incredible India. Incredible India. All right. You can see he's a writer, communication, leadership, and personality development. And more information about him. He has his own clubs and also he's a moderator at sustainability leadership which is a very nice club as well and also you can find his instagram and twitter let's click on his instagram and follow him on his instagram and twitter let's check twitter and follow him as well because this is the right way for networking actions that speak louder than words it means when you know a person when you can resonate with them when you like them don't be silent do something take action and follow each other the clubhouse is a fantastic platform for networking is a wonderful place to find the friends of course i always say follow each other but never follow someone's that their bio is empty because if someone has the empty bio it means they don't care about themselves if they don't want to introduce themselves to you why do you want to take a risk so please follow the people that they have a complete bio. They link their Instagram or Twitter to their bio. That's how they can show themselves. And that's another secret of the elevator pitch, to be ready, to be complete, to have everything with you, to do something fantastic in networking. One more time, thank you so much, Siddharth. I appreciate your time and being here. All right, let's go to the next lovely person. If any of you can speak, it's a popcorn style. We don't want to push you to speak because we know sometimes the people drive in. So safety is always priority. But if you can speak, uh, please flash your mic. Or if you are in audience, you can just simply raise your hand and come to the stage. Let us know you. Let the people know you, especially when they are on the other platforms. I can see Dr. Masood also joined us. And Mike is also here. Mike, do you want to speak? Yes. So first of all, I would like to thank you. Uh, thank you very much. I love your energy. I'm a firm believer of the law of attraction, vibration, and <laughs> we can feel your energy. And uh, I believe there's more pleasure to give rather to receive. And the fact that you're giving back to the community, the fact that you're giving back to the people, this is a room. This is a beautiful room. I love it. Um, in the meantime, about myself, what I do, I believe in quality over quantity. And like you said, it's all a question of action because 
Usually there's three types of people in this world. There's people they make things happen, people they watch. What's the happen? People they wonder what the hell just happened. I'm someone who likes to make things happen. One of the best book I ever read, it's good to great from Jim Carter. When you work with the best, you become a better version of yourself. So myself, what I do, I don't think I believe in quality over quantity. So if you got a company and you want to bring the company to the next level, if you got a company, you got a product or you got a service, and definitely I'm the advertising guy. I'm the one who's going to build the inbound marketing. I'm the one who's going to take your product and your service. Right now, like I said, um, I believe one of the most powerful thing is not money, but it's time. So right now I'm taking five people, five people that basically those people, they want to have the help of someone who's going to help them in terms of social media in terms of advertising help them the company to go to million to multi-million company that's what i do so this is my it was a pleasure love everyone i'm sending some love um and i'm sending and i want to wish everyone a happy holiday time and 2022 is going to be your year 2022 is going to be a year of blessing and we are going to make things happen thank you very much Wow, such a powerful share. That was fantastic, Mike. Thank you so much for being here. You know, that's really lovely that so good people like Michael is on the stage. So the followers like Mike uh, came here. And that's that's the meaning of synergy. I loved it. Mike, you are amazing. That was a powerful share. You are a source of inspiration as well, Mike. All right, everyone, you can just click on Mike's profile picture. It's time to take action. Check his bio. Uh, and of course, you can find his Instagram. I recommend you, Mike, if you can later put some more information about yourself in your bio, that will be much, much better because more people can know you more. But anyway, thank you again for being here. Let's go to the next lovely person. Yeah, it's a hot mic here. Oh, Pooja, how are you? Pooja, are you ready to share? Yes, I am. <laughs> All right, Pooja, thank you for coming. Yes, Mike is yours. Thank you, Syed, and good morning to all. So while presenting your page, you need to keep your body straight and your posture straight. That is the first foremost thing, whether even if you're talking on clubhouse, it does not matter because your posture has to be straight and your energy high and commanding. What happens is when we sit and we uh, bend over, the message does not come across. And because as early humans, we were solely dependent on the non-verbal and the sign language, what happens is when when uh, the when the the person if he's not if if what happens is when he's not putting across his words which if the words are not in agreement with the voice and the body language then the listener tends to believe the non-verbal element so that's why whether even if you're talking on clubhouse it does not matter you need to keep your posture straight and that is the biggest thing for me and the next uh, thing is your elevator pitch has to be very short meaningful and get to the point what do you help people with who are you who do you help what do you do and how you help them all in one single line because people don't have time nor do they really can understand beyond a certain particular time so you have to be very clear and and third is i i would suggest it you it, your message has to be not only attractive but compelling enough for them to take action so you need to have a clear call to action. It does not matter what conversion point you use, but at least like a link to your uh, Instagram page or to your uh, scheduler link or to your landing page, it does not matter, but needs to have a compelling call to action. And then be mindful of the impression you give because people are picking up your vibe, you're, they're picking up your energy and your Though your bio introduces all of that, but the first impressions do matter and pe because of the vibe and because of the energy they're getting. And that's what I have for you. Thank you so much for giving me this opportunity to talk. Wow, wonderful, Pooja. Thank you so much. Golden Nuggets, that was really wonderful. That's really nice. You know, Pooja, you are always good. You're amazing. And thanks for your share. It's time to take 
action now. Pooja is a wonderful, wonderful lady. You can just click on her profile picture. Of course, I shared the link of her bio as well, but you can just do it now. Even if you're watching this as replay, you can just do the same. At the same time, I was displaying your bio, Pooja, in front of the camera, because right now we are live on 12 platforms, including Instagram, YouTube, Facebook, Twitter, LinkedIn, and a couple of more platforms. All right, let's take action now and click on Pooja's profile with me and then check out her bio. Pooja is an amazing funnel strategist and funnel builder, builds website and membership sites, business mentor, marketing and sales strategies, course creator, content creator, Facebook ads strategies, and many, many more. So please follow her. Remember to click the bell, set it on always. So anytime Pooja speaks anywhere, you will receive the notifications on Clubhouse. And also you follow her Instagram as well. Thank you very much, Pooja. All right, we will continue another few minutes our flight because we have so many lovely people on the stage. One more time, I want to say happy holidays and merry christmas and happy new year 2022 to all of you all right if any of you ready to speak please flash your mic because the stage is yours and we want to know you if you want to share anything about the topic yes smita smita please correct my pronunciation if wrong smita mic is yours yeah you said it right it's not wrong at all uh, Smita, sorry, sorry, I think it's a little metrics. All right, now it's better. For a few seconds, your voice was not clear. I think there was a poor connection. Now it's better. Sorry, go ahead. I think she had the technical issue and she left. But anyway, I shared her uh, bio, the link of her bio. Probably she had a poor connection until she comes back. I, I think she was right regarding the smile. I do agree. Uh, you know, I want to repeat this one. Smile is very important. Even on your profile picture, it really works. It really works for communication, even with, in Clubhouse. <laughs> You know, in Clubhouse, when you have a profile picture with the smile on your face, it really helps to communicate even with your profile picture. And, you know, I always say life is like the mirror. If you smile, smile comes to greet you. All right, let's go to the next person until she's back. But anyway, I shared her uh, bio's link here. As I said, we are live on 12 platforms and I'm uh, happy to pass the mic to you. Please flash your mic. Unmute. Yes, Dr. Masood, you are amazing. I thought you are in UK and probably it's too early to speak. But anyway, thank you for being here. Mike is yours. Thank you, Dr. Masood. Uh, 
Thank you very much. No, I'm in the operating room, and uh, one of my uh, one of my residents is operating, and I saw your uh, your 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 room, and I thought, come and say hello. Yeah, absolute pleasure. I wish everybody happy holidays, uh, Christmas, New Year. Wish you health and prosperity. And uh, it's a really difficult time with this Corona economic condition all over the world. But I think these things will pass, and hopefully. Uh, humanity coming together with this in dif this difficult time will uh, make a better future for our uh, children. And we are, uh, in, in in England, we got a really bad, uh, basically uh, Corona cases at the moment, and uh, and and the, the hospital about twenty percent of workforce at the moment is off sick. But we wish them well. Luckily, this new version is not causing too much trouble. Uh, I'm a I'm a eye surgeon, uh, but uh, I've been a photographer and uh, have had many exhibitions, and um, uh, and also I'm a poet in Persian Persian poetry, and have an interest in mathematics. And whilst we were designing our new hospital in the south of England, if you're any of you are in Britain, you're more than welcome to see. I designed it to be like an art gallery. And what we done in the art gallery is that I'm, uh, uh, my uh, Dr. Masood, I cannot hear you. Anyone can hear Dr. Masood? It's my problem. No, I, I couldn't. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. All right. I think there was a technical issue. Something. Yeah, probably I'll, he's. I'll take this chance really quickly, say to, to wish you all a very, very Christmas, Happy New Year, and Happy Holidays. No matter what you're celebrating, may it be good. May, may you have health, happiness, prosperity, and love, and peace, and fulfillment. Thank you so much. Same to you. Same, same. Thank you very much. Uh, really happy holiday to everyone. Merry Christmas and Happy New Year 2022. Yes, thank you, Michael. You are amazing. You are so kind and really wonderful person. I appreciate that. Yeah, Dr. Masood was speaking. Probably there was a technical issue. Anyway, I shared his uh, bio's um, link. Let's click on his profile picture now. You know that this clubhouse is amazing, amazing because we can find such a good people and also we can optimize our business as well. And we learn from each other. We expand our network. Business relationship can be improved and lots of advantages. And, you know, because we have a product that's anti demodex mite, I was in touch with Dr. Masood. He's the eye surgeon, eye doctor, ophthalmologist, and because he's a health professional. And there is a skin issue. The name is blepharitis and many people they suffer from that skin issue on their eyelashes and normally they refer to eye doctors because of that you know serious skin issue and most of the time they they cannot have the permanent solution but because we have a product that can help eliminate parasites that they are linked to blepharitis i was in touch with dr masood and uh, you know because he's an eye doctor to help networking with the with the uh, actually health professionals in uk to introduce our products to them so it means this platform is really multi-purpose to find the good friends to learn from each other and also to improve our business anyway dr masood if you cannot speak for whatever reason or it's technical issues okay i shared your link here i want everyone it's time to take action now click on Ma dr masu's profile right now you can read his bio he's in uk uh he's an um, uh, ophthalmologist eye surgeon photographer uh, and also more information about him you can find in his bio as well as his instagram and twitter please give him a follow all right let's go ahead if anyone else wants to speak about the topic or you want to introduce yourself we have a few minutes left Yes, Smitha, if you want to chime in, let's go ahead. Yeah, so uh, I lost connectivity, I believe. Oh, yeah, 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 I remember. <laughs> yeah, you are right. There was a poor connection. Of course, I, I shared the link of your bio. But yes, it's good to complete your speech. Go ahead, please. Yeah, so uh, I just wanted to know, uh, Sayez, where exactly did you lose me? Uh, do you want me to start from the beginning? <laughs> 
<laughs> that's a difficult question you know i'm because right <laughs> i'm I, I will fail because you know uh, i'm right now on 12 platforms and at the same time i'm looking at the camera because many people uh, send me message on instagram and i was just trying to play the role of the pilot to show the bio and i to be honest i i think at the same time which i told you you have poor connection after 10 seconds we lost you probably if you if you remember <laughs> you are the best person <laughs> that I was saying was be friendly and keep smiling. Uh, even if you, you are in an audio room like this, your tone shows, you know, whether you are a friendly person and whether you have that smile or not, whether you're carrying that smile or not. So if you want to really get the conversation going, keep the conversation, uh, you know, more interactive, more open, and you want people uh, to like you, then it's very crucial that you behave friendly and you keep smiling. Uh, second aspect is listen with concentration. We learn a lot from each other. So it's not about just we, we talking all the time, but we also have to give an opportunity to others to talk and you have to listen with concentration uh, so that you understand the other person's point of view and there is no kind of uh, misunderstanding obviously and most important you learn when you observe when you listen you learn a lot so it's crucial that you listen with con uh, concentration third aspect that i would like to talk about is be flexible and active in conversation you know usually uh, you know what happens is human nature is that when somebody proves that we are wrong we take that as an insult you know so don't take it as an insult in fact thank the person that he or she has corrected you and you have learned something from that person so uh, you know you always have to believe in the fact that you are learning uh, till you die we keep learning from each other we always keep learning uh, from one another so don't be very rigid about your beliefs your thoughts it's okay to say yes i was wrong or oh i understand what i believed or what i said is wrong and thank you for correcting me thank you for teaching me you know so be flexible and be active in your conversations and then give compliments giving compliments is very very important to make the other person feel comfortable to make the other person feel uh, valued it is very very crucial that we learn to give compliments that's it with that and I'm, I'm done speaking thank you wonderful wonderful thank you very much smita thank you for your amazing and excellent sharing golden nuggets you are absolutely right smile is very important after you actually had the uh, connection issue i just repeated the same thing regarding smile and you are absolutely right we need to listen and learn we never should stop never ever stop learning we should be lifetime learner. And the more you learn, the more you earn. That's a wonderful sentence. The more you learn, the more you earn. All right. Thank you so much, Smitha. Now I shared the link of your bio. And I want everyone to take action now and follow Smitha. Let's click on her profile picture, which I also linked it. You can just read uh, her bio. And if you resonate with her bio, please follow her. You can also click the bell. When you click the bell, set it on always. It means anytime she speaks on the clubhouse, you will receive the notifications. Also, follow her on her Instagram. Thank you so much. Let's go to the next lovely person, Bali Paul. Thank you for your patience. Mike is yours. Thank you, Shayet great to be here what a, uh, a great energetic room so um yeah i love this one this subject and um you know over the 10 years or so last 10 years or so i've been all over the place with it uh, you know all different uh, um, approaches but this is my favorite this is my current position and i'll demonstrate it and then give you the formula if it's any good to anyone you can have it so 
it's typically one of those, what do you do, isn't it? You know, people ask the question, what do you do? So the first thing is, I ask them a question. I say, do you know, do you know how coaches, do you know in the coaching industry, the failure rate is so high, like nine out of 10 coaches fail in a year. You know about that, don't you? Yes. Well, my coaches don't. 90% of them succeed. In fact, the average coach in my community is six figures plus. And our little secret formula is one discovery call a day with one in two buying a thousand dollars worth of coaching off you is 175k per year that is what we strive for so that's what i do i don't suppose you know any coaches who are struggling who should be speaking to me do you that's it that's the formula now I'll just i'll just rip it apart and just dissect it most people expect you to go straight in with the well i help what i'm doing is i'm pat, i'm interrupting the pattern by saying do you know how so whatever your niche is do you know how digital marketers struggle with this do you know how uh new entrepreneurs struggle with uh imposter syndrome do you know how so do you know how and then you quote your niche and what that what it's known that they struggle with and then they'll say yeah i do I, i'm well aware of that well my uh, uh, entrepreneurs my digital marketers my new coaches my new uh, 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 my um spiritual psychics whatever it is whatever the niche is mine don't suffer from that instead in fact and then you t- go to the reverse and you tell them what your people do achieve. And then you give them a golden nugget. Give them something that's gold. I, I did the little one discovery call a day with one in two buying a thousand dollars with a coach. It's 175 grand a year. And that's what, so you give them a little nugget, something to get them thinking. And then you finish off by not closing. You are not closing. You are absolutely not pitching. So what you do is you do a negative a negative uh, uh, exit and you say i don't suppose you know any digital marketers and coaches whatever i don't suppose you know any who are struggling right now who should be talking to me do you now if the person in question that we're talking to is a perfect candidate we're giving them the pride and they're able to say now i'll have to think about it if i do it and you can say well well if you do you give a business card, you give a, uh, a number, you give a WhatsApp, you give a, uh, uh, Instagram, um, uh, uh, profile, you know, your, or your, your ID or, you know, you give them something so that they can contact you. If you do come across any who are struggling and they should be talking to me, pass, pass my name on. I'm always, always grateful to help digital marketers, entrepreneurs, whatever. And that's how you finish. So if that's any good to anybody here, it's been worth me rambling on for the next three minutes. Thank you for letting me contribute, Syed. Thank you. Wow, wonderful. That was amazing. Thank you so much, Bali. That was a wonderful and great share. I really appreciate that. Thank you for your share. Thank you for being here. And at the same time, when you had your beautiful speech and your share, I turned my phone toward the camera because we are right now live on 12 platforms to let the other people also enjoy and learn from you on Instagram, YouTube, (laughs) Facebook. Yeah, because now I'm live on 12 platforms. Usually when it's in my own club, I'll go live on um, other platforms, other social accounts like Instagram, YouTube, Facebook, Twitter. And I try to use all these things together to see how we can actually connect people even if they don't have Clubhouse, I try to encourage them to install the Clubhouse on their phone. Anyway, Bali, you are amazing. Thank you for your sharp. You're putting people, you put, it, you put my name up. That is so sharp, Sayed. Wow. 
<laughs> thank you very much thank you yeah that's 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 uh, honestly i love to know the people i love to uh, get connected and i love to let the people get connected to each other because we are all passengers of the same flight that's my metaphor when i run my you know sessions in different clubs say all the eight billion people we can just imagine and visualize that this beautiful planet earth is like the airplane with 8 billion passengers. And I think that was a great lesson from coronavirus that showed us that we are all connected, no matter where, which country you are, what's your nationality, what is your health profession, profession or whatever. It means that we are all good connected to each other. So it's good to help each other, to spread love, to let the people learn. And sharing is helping, is caring. And when you had such a wonderful share, I was enjoying to share it with others. Thank you so much, Bali. All right, everyone, it's time to take action. Click on Bali's profile picture right now on Clubhouse. And I'm showing on other platforms as well <laughs> in front of the camera on YouTube, LinkedIn, Facebook, Instagram. Anyway, so check his bio and remember to follow him and click the bell. You know, every single feature on Clubhouse has a reason. There is a philosophy. It's not just for fun. It's just to use it, to take action. Click the bell. It means when you resonate with uh, Bali's bio and his thoughts, please click the bell and set it on always. So in this way, anytime, anywhere on Clubhouse he speaks, you will receive the notifications. Also, you can follow him on his Instagram and Twitter. You should do it, actually. <laughs> All right. Thank you one more time, Bali. Uh, actually, here in Australia is 9.20 p.m. And I need to rush to go home within the next 10 minutes because I believe my wife is waiting for me. And I always say, happy wife, happy life. So before she gets angry, I need to finish it. So we have 10 more minutes to know more people. If you are here and you wish to share, just flash your mic. And then I'll be more than happy to pass the mic to you to uh, actually let you speak. Anyone on the stage or in audience, if you are in audience, we have 10 minutes more before landing. So if you want to speak, just raise your hand. But be sure to have a complete bio. Complete bio means mention who you are, what you do, what you look for. If you have any target audience and a couple of things you can do to optimize your bio. The most important thing is to link it with your Instagram or Twitter or both of them because that's really helpful for the people to click and check your uh, check your Instagram and ve verify you as a real person. That's good for validation. All right, thank you so much. I think there is no one else to speak, so probably we will land earlier. But one more time, let me see. Anyone on the stage want to speak or want to share? I can see a few people, they, they came here and I was really happy that from very beginning I started this room. And well, another thing which I always encourage the people, even if you don't want to speak, still is good to come to the stage. In my room and in some clubs, normally we never uh, move to audience anyone because if even you cannot speak, being on the stage is good for yourself and for us, for, for everyone. Let me tell you why. When you come to the stage, imagine you are driving and you cannot speak or you want to sleep for whatever reason. You, you want to support other people friends, club, room. So you come to the stage. As soon as you come to the stage, more people will find you. It's good to optimize your visibility, optimize your personal branding because the people, they come, even this room will be recorded or I display the picture in front of the camera. So many people will know you. It will, it's really helpful to improve your personal branding, even if you cannot speak. The second thing is when you are on the stage, all your followers will receive the notifications of this room. So it's helpful for the room because you will help your friends to find the room and you help us to find your friends. So that's really good. This application, I think, in Clubhouse is everyone is a winner. Everyone. It means that it's mutually beneficial for all of us. All right. Thank you so much for your time, for being here. I really appreciate every single person that they joined this room. Uh, we had more than 116, 116 people uh, came to this room. And at the same time, many people on other platforms like Instagram, YouTube, Facebook, Twitter, LinkedIn. Um, anyway, thank you again. 
and I want you to be ready for a quick landing, for a quick landing. But before landing, I want to wish you very, very Merry Christmas and a very happy New Year 2022 for all of you. And I really hope that you enjoy your holidays. Happy holidays. All right, everyone, be ready for landing. I repeat again, I use this metaphor because I want to help myself and you to visualize the reality of the life. The fact that we are all passengers, passengers in this airplane. The name is planet Earth. And it may take 100 years, 80 years, 70 years. So it's better we enjoy at, and live at the present time. We spread love. We help each other. We help each other by sharing you can help. Sharing is caring. Helping each other, spreading love, and be grateful, be humble, and appreciate the people, and try to optimize your network with lovely people, with the friends, because a friend in need is a friend indeed. Definitely your friends will be your main assets. All right, everyone. Thank you very much. Again, I appreciate your time and thank you for being here. And now I want you to be ready for landing. Cabin crew, please take your seats for landing. All right, everyone, we landed safe and sound. <laughs> thank you very much, everyone. Appreciate. I'd like to thank you for joining me on this quick trip. And I'm looking forward to seeing you on board again in my next session. Have a lovely day, evening and night. And one more time, happy holidays, Merry Christmas and Happy New Year 2022. But remain in your seat because I leave the room. Yes, yes, Michael, go. There's a friend of mine in, this, in the audience. Can I try to bring him up? Can he can he make a comment? Let's see if he wants to comment. Yes, 100%. 100%. You need, to, you, need to, you need to circle the airport a couple times. Hang on. <laughs> no problem. No problem. You can keep your your fast, your seats, uh, keep on your seat and be ready. No problem, Michael. Go ahead. Let's see. Let's see if he comes up. Hey, he's coming up. There he is. Paul, hey. Paul, welcome, hey. sis. <laughs> howdy, howdy. Good morning from Las Vegas, Nevada. Thank you for bringing me up, man. Thank you so much. How is everyone? I hope everyone is doing well. It's great to see everyone. I didn't know you were going to bring me up. I'm sorry. That's okay. <laughs> hey, uh, Saeed, ask him uh, about the pitch, okay? How to give an elevator pitch, Paul. We're talking about how to give an elevator pitch. Oh, okay. Well, for both like film and for business, because I, I feel like they're so similar. Whatever you want, man. You're the funny guy on this stage right now. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, well, I make it nice, nice and nice and quick. Uh, but the one I've been doing lately is is for my new yoga company, Bad Ombre Yoga. So we're, we're just making equipment that's comfortable and easier to use for the person of size i don't know if that's a quick enough elevator pitch for you but that's what i've been working with so far i still need it still needs work i also have one for my movie if i can find it uh i wasn't ready for this uh let's see uh agent g it was the, the, the secret agent that's no, not so secret. See, I should always be ready. Agent G, uh, where is it? Uh, pitch. I don't know, I can't find it. <laughs> What's your insight and, and uh, what, what, do you, what do you think you need to do to get a good pitch? And Why? Well, practice. I think practice is, is, is going to be probably the most important thing. Uh, when, when people uh, practice their pitch and concise because nobody's got time. It literally has to be uh, something that you pitch an executive or a producer in, in you know, less than, than a minute, half, you know, 30 seconds. 
So I think that's the most important thing about elevator pitches. You know, concise, they describe everything and you get it right away. You know, such and such show meets such and such show. You're like, okay, yeah, I get it. So, so that's not that I'm doing a good job. <laughs> hey, I know you're put on the spot, but you should have heard, you should hear uh, Saeed earlier that he's, he's so full of energy. We we're about to land the plane, and somehow you you parachuted inside the plane. So, <laughs> <laughs> oh, good. Now I can land safely, man. Thank you so much for allowing me to be a part of it. I'll, I'll get ready. Next time you do the room, I'll have a pitch ready for you guys. <laughs> that was wonderful. Thank you so much, Michael, and thank you, Paul. That was excellent. Thank you. That you made my night. I have to say night because now is night twenty-eight. You made my day. You made my week. Anyway, thank you so much, Michael. Thank you, Paul. Thank you for the amazing share. Yeah, you just came after landing, just last minute. That was really wonderful, and I really liked it. Thank you, Paul. All right, I shared the link of your bio, and uh, I'm not sure if you are aware or not. We are right now live on 12 platforms, not only Clubhouse, but also on Instagram, YouTube, Facebook, Twitter, LinkedIn. So I actually displayed your bio in front of the camera for other people that they can also enjoy and learn from you, Paul. You are amazing. All right, last, last action, last but not least. Let's click on Paul's profile picture right now with me everyone even if you are watching this as replay you can do the same all right let's know him more he was amazing actor improviser vo artist entrepreneur youtuber podcaster and many more please follow him remember to click the bell on the top and set it on always. So it means anytime anyone on Clubhouse Paul speaks, you will receive the notifications from Clubhouse. And remember to check his bio completely. He's amazing, he's amazing. And you should also check his Instagram right now, not tomorrow, tomorrow never comes, right now. Please check his Instagram and follow him right away, now. And his Twitter, let's do it now before we end the room because even one brilliant person comes to our network we are richer we are oh my goodness christoph is also here from germany last second we have two first class passengers christoph you are so good you are so good all right everyone please follow paul and now before we end the room just the last second christoph is an amazing person a very, very lovely, powerful, amazing, wonderful person from Germany. Christoph, do you want to speak? Thank you very much, Said. Uh, I think uh, you are the most amazing guy I know. Yes, uh, Said from Australia, you are a fantastic moderator. Your energy is absolutely amazing, inspiring, and dynamic. And I really enjoy when you are talking and motivating everybody Yes, uh, to build up the network. Network is so important, and uh, that's absolutely amazing how you are doing it. Thank you very much for your invitation to your room. Uh, and uh, I could not join earlier because we have uh, here Christmas Eve, and uh, we are preparing with all the family for our dinner. And I just uh, went to buy the uh, fresh uh, filet meat, yes, uh, for the fondue, what we are preparing. And uh, yeah, I'm really excited uh, for Christmas and I want to thank you and uh, for your fantastic club and moderation. And yeah, whenever anybody would like to know more about Germany and uh, doing business in the real estate or construction industry here, especially how to use digital tools uh, and uh, improve the value chain uh, of uh, building construction, then uh, Please contact me. That's my passion. And uh, thank you very much, Said. And have a wonderful Merry Christmas to all of you. Well, thank you so much. Merry Christmas to you and happy holidays, Christoph. And also, I wish you a very, very happy New Year 2022 uh, in advance. Christoph, you are wonderful. I shared the link of your bio. You are amazing. I want everyone now is the last action. Last but not least. Click on Christoph's profile picture. He's a wonderful moderator in another club as well. But I want you right now to take action. Check his bio. Christoph, 
Christoph, management consultant, entrepreneur, and more information about him from beautiful Germany. Please follow him, click the bell, set it on always. Don't forget these things. You know, these are the things very simple. It takes only one second, only one second to click the bell and set it on always. But you can see the result because anytime Christopher speaks anywhere on Clubhouse, you will receive the notifications. So please follow him, click the bell, set it on always. Also click on his Instagram, follow him on his Instagram. You can see he's such a wonderful, amazing, handsome gentleman from Germany. All right. Thank you so much, Christoph. Thank you, everyone. And now... Happy New Year to you as well. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, Christoph. Thank you. Thank you. Appreciate I know that you want to go to enjoy this Christmas. So do I, because here is also 9.33 p.m. I have only two minutes left to go. But within these two minutes, I want to play a music. And I want to say bye to the people, everyone on Instagram, YouTube, because actually I need to end the other platform first. The reason is when I play the music, it has a copyright and is not allowed to be played on Instagram. So just let me say bye. I shake hands to everyone on Instagram. Thank you for joining us. Happy holidays. Okay, let me end that one. The reason is first I need to end that one.